giving up. Mm, please don't. My brain's too fried to come up with a witty repartee I know I'm gonna need for this conversation. Sorry, I just came to get my ink. <clears throat> I didn't know you could do that. Do what? Apologize. <laughs> well, I guess you aren't so brain dead after all. Sorry. I've just been reading these for hours and it's gotten me nowhere. It's cool. I get it. What are those? Letters John wrote to Emily. They were in the police records. She had them on her when she died. I love letters. My dearest E, my love for you is infinite. I would swim oceans, move mountains, risk my very being to stay by your side. You are mine and I am yours always. J. Hmm. They really were in love, weren't they? Yeah. Um, so I was thinking maybe I should interview you. For the vlog, I mean. I was afraid you might ask me that. So, can I? What? Interview you. Oh, that was you asking me. <laughs> You're infuriating. Why are you like that? Like what? Why can't you answer a simple question? I can. So, you do it? I guess so, but I don't know what you could possibly gain from me. Um, you're the current owner of the house. You're part of its history, whether you like it or not. Well, yeah, I might own it, but like I've been saying to you, I've never lived here before, so even you and your little sidekick probably know more about it than I do. Don't worry about it. You might know more than you realize once we actually sit down and talk about it. Okay, but I'm just saying, don't go expecting wine from me when all I've got is grapes. Where's Jack? Out running. What is that? I have no idea. Who's there? Okay, that wasn't creepy at all. Where was it coming from? At least we got it on camera. Jack would never believe us otherwise. All right, cool. Um, I gotta go back to work. But I guess I can sit down with you tomorrow. <laughs>